everybody, welcome back to Real Real Reviews. This is Cody Williams, and we are here to talk about the movie Top Gun Maverick. It is the long-awaited sequel to the cult classic film from the 80s that I've been super eager to see, given how many times it's been delayed. Lo and behold, it's finally in theaters, and I've watched it, and I'm ready to talk about it. After more than 30 years of service as one of the Navy's top aviators, Pete Maverick Mitchell is where he belongs, pushing the envelope as a courageous test pilot and dodging the advancement in rank that would ground him. Training a detachment of graduates for a special assignment, Maverick must confront the ghost of his past and his deepest fears, culminating in a mission that demands the ultimate sacrifice from those who choose to fly it. Hoo-wee! I just can't tell you how much I love this movie because it's that outstanding. As it may be a nostalgia trip for the fans of old, it does advance the story with new narratives that I found to be very fascinating. This movie has a lot of things going for it, but I will say that it does have heart, jaw-dropping, adrenaline-fueled action sequences that are mesmerizing, excellent acting from everyone, an awesome soundtrack, and also some gorgeous cinematography that will take your breath away. <laughs> First off, the best thing the movie has to offer is how much respect it pays to the original film with many references. There's a lot of references and tributes to go around, but it sure did make me happy, and I'm sure others will feel the same. A lot of people give sequels a bad rep because in the majority they are underwhelming, but there are a few, like this movie in this instance, that stand out as groundbreakers that subvert anyone's ideas about sequels. It may be bold to say, but I think this movie is just as good as the original, or perhaps even better. As far as nostalgia goes, almost every one of the main legacy characters return except for you know who. Say what you will about Tom Cruise as a person, but you cannot deny the fact that he is one of the biggest action stars in the business and does not hold back when it comes to acting. I also liked how Val Kimmer returns as Iceman in an almost respectable manner given the circumstances of his personal health. Only briefly mentioned in the first movie, you have Jennifer Connelly as the love interest for Maverick, who wound up being really good. As far as new characters go, I really enjoyed Miles Teller as Rooster. It's pretty obvious his character is the son of Goose, and Miles Teller really portrays the resentful character tremendously well. His character has a great story arc throughout the movie that has an amazing payoff that I thoroughly enjoyed. I sure do love me some high altitude dogfights as much as anyone does, but this sequel makes it more immersive than ever as it puts you in the cockpit with the way the movie was filmed. I don't know how else to describe it, but the camera work really makes the action scenes a little bit more visceral and more intimate this time around, making the film's action scenes much more enjoyable than it had every right to be. The action scenes were so intense and anxiety inducing, it left me on the edge of my seat, not knowing what to expect. As much as I anticipate to say, this sequel delivered everything I wanted out of this movie, and then some. I can easily see this movie becoming the biggest blockbuster of the year, by far. If you really want to experience this film at its best, I would highly recommend seeing this in IMAX if you have the chance. Overall, Top Gun Maverick is a magnificent movie that goes beyond the reaches of how a true legacy sequel should be made, whereas it's not afraid to venture off into new territory while it remembers where it came from. As it may be with several years of development under its belt, this film is a technical achievement and should be celebrated as such because it's a perfectly made movie. I give this movie an A+. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel to keep up with my real reviews.